From the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good morning to you, wherever you may be. I'm Jake Lang, back from the Penn State Campus Weather Service. We have a forecast on this Wednesday, the 30th of November, 2016. It is a foggy and dreary start to the day across Happy Valley. You really can't see Beaver Stadium right now because it's all shrouded in fog. Currently outside, 45 degrees, calm winds, but zero visibility. So if you're making your way towards work or school today, give yourselves a little extra time for your travel because the roads may be a little bit treacherous on this Wednesday. Weather headlines for today, this last day of meteorological fall. Rainy and mild will be the theme du jour, but cooler weather is ahead for the rest of the week. We are looking at a chance of rain, snow showers even for Sunday night into Monday morning. I'll time that on my seven-day forecast coming up in just a couple of minutes time. First things first, temperatures across central PA right now, 49 in Bradford, 45 State College. Chilly across central PA, but if you go to the east or the west, a little bit warmer. 58 right now in Erie, and if you're going down to the southeast, 56 right now in Philadelphia. Good morning to you fine folks. Radar satellite shows rain showers moving into western PA, but the big story is down south around Alabama, Tennessee. We are looking at a severe thunderstorm warning to start off the day, especially around Chattanooga, Huntsville, Alabama. Yesterday, we had over 100 confirmed reports of tornadoes, high winds and hail across Louisiana into Mississippi, Alabama, into Tennessee. The worst of the severe weather is over, but we'll be keeping a close eye on this as the morning continues. As for us, though, we do have some rain showers moving in for this morning. They'll be tapering off by the afternoon. Cloudy skies throughout much of the day, but we do have another band of rain coming in later tonight. Nothing too much in the way of accumulations, just maybe some heavier pockets of showers at times. But other than that, though, expect a partly to mostly cloudy night. For tomorrow, though, expect maybe a few pockets of flurries, especially around the higher terrain of Cambria and Clearfield County, but no accumulations whatsoever. Just a few spotty showers here and there and just a cloudy sky for much of central PA. Rainfall accumulations anywhere from a quarter to a third of an inch in northern northwestern PA. Down to the southeast, though, a little bit higher accumulations around three quarters of an inch to maybe an inch, especially around the lower valleys, but nothing too much in the way of flood concerns. Temperature-wise, 50s and 60s for much of the day, but we have a cold front coming through later tonight. Watch that 42 degree temperature reading there. That is going to be the highest we get to on Thursday. Many areas will struggle, get, will struggle to get out of the 30s and 40s. It is going to be a very chilly day for your Thursday and Friday too. Quite chilly indeed. Many areas will struggle to get out of the mid 30s. For today though, enjoy this mild weather while you can. Periods of rain with mild conditions, 58 degrees. For tonight though, that cold front will move through. We'll be looking at an overnight low of around 38. Rain showers will be tapering off overnight. We'll be left with drier conditions by the time we wake up tomorrow morning. And we do have a football game to tell you about the Penn State Wisconsin game, the Big Ten Championship game in Indianapolis for Saturday. Kickoff time 8 p.m. with a temperature of 37 degrees. It is an indoor game, though, but if you're making your way across Indianapolis, please bring a jacket. It is going to be quite chilly, especially late Saturday night into early Monday morning. Good luck to our Nittany Lions as they go for the Big Ten Championship. 7 8 forecast goes a little something like this. Cloudy and cool will be the theme for much of the rest of the week. Look at those temperatures. Seasonal for much of the rest of the week. And like I said, we're looking at a chance of rain, showers, possibly even some wet snowflakes for Sunday night into Monday morning. Temperatures will be right around freezing, so do be aware if you're heading out during that time. And let's look at the weather in your neck of the woods from the Penn State Campus Weather Service. I'm Jake Langdike. Have a wonderful Wednesday, friends.